Good morning. I am very wrapped up this morning. This is one of the scarves I made last year and they were so long, you can wrap them around twice and so I feel like I can barely move but I feel like it might be quite chilly today. Anyway, me and my friends are going to get some breakfast bagels which is going to be swell. So I thought I'd start the vlog now because I'm leaving right now. It's half ten and I woke up probably about 10, 20 minutes ago. So breakfast bagels. since this morning um but I went and got bagels with my friends and then I went up to college with my other friend um and I've been working on some stuff I've actually been asked by one of the one of my favorite mental health companies yeah they're a UK charity company called No Panic and they are amazing they my favorite thing is that um, I feel like there's quite a lot of mental health websites that focus on mainly depression or mainly other things. I've not really found other websites or things like this that focus just on anxiety, which is what I suffer with and I know a lot of you suffer with. Um, I'm going to leave their link down below because their website is really cool. It's got everything on it, really, really everything on it. Um, and I just think they're a really cool company and they've actually asked me to write some blog posts for them, which is so exciting. Like. I love writing, but I don't have like a blog or anything like that because I just don't think I'd have the time to keep up with like a YouTube channel and a blog as well as like college and work and all that kind of stuff. Um, so I'm really, really, really excited to be asked to do that because it's just, I love writing and especially love writing about anxiety because it's what I know best, I think. Um, and yeah, I'm really excited about that. So I've been working on that quite a lot this afternoon, but seriously, I'd really, really recommend going and checking it out because there is absolutely everything on there. They also have really cool things on their website that are like, if you are, they have a helpline, so if you are in urgent need of help, and um, they also have, colors now. like, if you're having a panic attack right in that moment, they have like, um, audio, like meditation and stuff like that, like they've just got loads of really cool things, um, amazing resources, and I think they're a really, really cool charity, like, I just, I think they're fab. So check them out if you fancy finding some more um, useful resources. Um, but I will let you know how the blog posts and stuff go because I've not written for quite a while. So it's been really fun today writing, but it's also been like, I don't know what I'm doing. This could all be wrong. Um, so yeah, I also have to go out to work in about an hour. Anyway, I'm going to watch Grace and Frankie for a little while before work. My mum just came back from town and got me the first Christmas decoration of the year. Are you ready to see it? Because I'm going to have this up all year round, absolutely, no matter what. Look at it, it's so cute. Isn't this the sweetest thing you've ever seen in your life? It's a little hand-painted pot with like a felt cactus and these are like meant to be like the Christmas baubles around it and it's just so cute! Oh my god, I love it, even like the soil is like felt. It's just the cutest thing ever. I'm gonna have this up all year round. I love it. Currently putting on my shoes, going down to work. Um, I've not really been man I've not really managed to speak too much today in the vlog because it just kind of felt like I've constantly all day been doing different things that meant I couldn't actually film. So unfortunately, work is one of those things as well. So I do apologise. This vlog's probably been fairly short and fairly shit <laughs> um hopefully i managed to vlog a bit more tomorrow and um, i actually think i might just end this vlog here because i don't think anything else exciting is going to happen
today. <laughs> um, it is actually the next day. I'm putting these two vlogs together because yesterday I felt like it was just way too short to leave it by its on its own vlog. I have been up for quite a wee while. I've just been kind of chilling out this morning. I really like doing that if I'm feeling overwhelmed or not great. Taking things just really slowly, getting dressed and having a bath and going with makeup and stuff really slowly just seems to help a bit so I'm not feeling rushed and anxious. Also, I've not got anything on today that, that I have to do. I'm going to meet my friend in a bit with um, my goddaughter. Can I do this like this? Probably not. Oh, I did. Great. Um, and then later on I'm going, might be going out, but like I've not got anything on today that I have to do. So that feels like quite a relief. Um, and also I'm off college next week, which means I don't have anything next week. Um except work that I that I like have to do um as I've said a million times there's absolutely nothing in my life that I ever feel like I have to do because I just take all the pressure off of myself and just know that I'm doing my best and that's the way that the best way for me to kind of get on with things and yeah I don't know what I'm trying to say oh this is a great angle I'm just putting the back on my earring I would like to say a huge thank you to every single person that has commented or Instagrammed me or whatever about Vlogtober because I kind of have been feeling a wee bit self-conscious because obviously I've not got the most exciting life in the world and obviously the things I do in my life, a lot of the time I can't vlog them or, you know, it's just not the most interesting thing ever. I'm also quite self-conscious in public or when I'm with my friends, so I don't really want to, like, take out a camera. Um, but you guys seem to be really enjoying them and... I've had some comments that really, really like touched my heart and that sounds really cringy, but I have I've had comments from people saying all sorts of great, great, great things. Um, and it's just like, I never, ever, ever, ever goes unnoticed. Like I always read them and think about them and feel emotional about them. And I always feel genuine pride whenever somebody tells me that they've, that they've been like inspired or they've been doing well or they've done something, I don't know. I always feel genuinely like so excited and happy um so yeah just been a lot of loveliness recently surrounding this kind of community type thing um so yeah that's been cool anyway I need to go now um I'll let you know when I'm home I am home now this lighting is really weird is that a bit better yeah um I'm home now from going out with my friend and we actually ended up ended up being out longer than I thought and so it just not really vlogged much. Um I just had my dinner. I had a really good corn chili um with like guacamole and stuff. It was so good. Um I can't decide whether I'm gonna go out tonight either. I really can't decide. There's some good stuff on TV and I've got some things I'd like to do and just like feel like I want to get my life in order a little bit more. But then also I kind of want to go out tonight. Can't quite decide what I want to do yet. So yeah, I also feel a little bit coldy, but I'm not sure if it's because I've been around dogs today or if it's just that I'm a wee bit coldy today. I'm really, really looking forward to the next couple of weeks because next week I've not got college. I've not got anything on. I've not got any appointments on the Thursday, which I usually do. Um, so I'm literally pretty much free all next week, which is so good because it means I can catch up on so much stuff that I need to catch up on. And then the week after, my boyfriend is home for a couple of days and I've not seen him. It will be like two months since I've seen him. Um, and then I won't see him again till Christmas. So I'm so, so excited about that. So the next couple of weeks, I'm really looking forward to. I'm feeling suddenly quite down. And I get like this sometimes. Um... Like I said, a million, trillion, gazillion times, I've probably already said it in the vlog. But I only really suffer with anxiety. I don't really suffer with um, depression or anything like that. Um, but I do, because of my anxiety, sometimes get very low mood kind of things. Um, mainly when it's when I get really frustrated with not being able to do certain things. Um, and also sometimes around friendships, and I don't really know why. I just sometimes feel people don't like me or that I'm being stupid and I get 
it's very weird because I can go weeks and weeks and weeks and feel totally fine and know that my friends like me and not feel alone and be totally cool and then it'll take something very small to make me feel very 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 like everybody doesn't like me it's also a very difficult thing to talk about because you feel I think you feel quite self-conscious to talk about it because you feel like you're being attention seeking or just stupid I think it also doesn't help that my boyfriend doesn't live in Edinburgh anymore and so I can't just kind of like see him and chat with him whenever I want um it's made it a little bit harder and my friend just told me just now and I just started crying on the phone and I didn't really expect that but I just kind of wanted to share that with you because that was a part of my day and because um I think it's a very 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 common thing and I don't think it's just people with anxiety that get like that I think everybody most people I know um kind of have that when they sometimes just feel like paranoid or worried about friendships and relationships and worried about being alone and I think it's a very very common thing that people experience and so I kind of wanted to share that and if you're feeling like that right now or if you felt like that recently um, you're not alone in feeling like that and talk to people about it is what I would say. I think I will go out tonight because I think I if I just sit in I think I'm just gonna feel even worse. I think I'm just gonna think about whereas I, I know if I go out and I see my friends I can visibly see oh we're having fun and so they obviously like me. I don't know if this sounds ridiculous or if I've just kind of talked about something that I don't know just feeling really weird at the moment and I think these kind of periods with me they only last a few days and then I feel back to normal again so um yeah I'm gonna eat a couple more Oreos and then probably go out <laughs> half past one I'm sat watching YouTube videos with a bowl of rice krispies and I thought I would end the vlog here before I fall asleep um I've currently also got this little cat staring at me because I am eating food she thinks she's a dog she really thinks that she is a dog oh how cute is she oh Macy Moo hello gorgeous what's that Oh, you're such a good girl. <laughs> she will honestly eat anything. She is like the most dog-like cat ever. Anyway, I am going to go. Um, thank you very much for watching this vlog. And I will see you tomorrow. Bye.